Welcome to your Weather on Demand. I'm meteorologist Wesley Williams from UpperMichiganSource.com. Yesterday's high temperature 70, which is actually below normal. Well, the overnight low was also below normal. Hope you love that cool weather because no longer will we have below normal anything in the UP as far as temperatures are concerned because of a big upper ridge. You can see the clouds going around that upper ridge right now. That's affecting the central portions of the country, but that ridge will slowly slide eastward. And once we get underneath it, Temperatures will really rise across the area. Looking down towards the southern areas, though, it's still dealing with Tropical Storm Debbie continuing to bring a lot of rainfall to areas in Florida, as well as Georgia and the rest of the southeastern coast. But closer to home, much calmer, thanks to an area of high pressure is keeping us cool. Also, look at the cool temperatures, green on your temperature map across the upper Midwest. But in the west, it looks like a little bit warmer. These yellows indicating very hot weather. Weather, and uh, they'll deal with triple digit heat again later on today as uh, the heat continues across the plains. But with the south wind, some of that heat will start to head towards us. And that means that we could expect the heat up in our forecast. Today will be warmer than yesterday with some sunshine. Tomorrow, that low pressure system slides upwards towards Hudson Bay. And then we'll see a frontal disturbance draped along with it, possibly bringing us some clouds by tomorrow evening and maybe a chance of rain. But it doesn't look very good, and I'll show you it right now. Uh, we get some clouds maybe be in here by this evening overnight, but nothing to really write home about because they clear out on Wednesday. But here's that chance of rain I wanted to show you. Develops across Minnesota and starts to head eastward, but look at that. It fizzles out as we head into Thursday morning, so it's not really going to be any washouts, that's for sure, as that frontal system passes through because it's just too dry for it to give us uh, that much rain. High temperatures near 80 today into the 80s as we head into tomorrow and even hotter on Thursday. The model, yes, is saying 91 for the high expected in Iron Mountain on Thursday. Today, lakeshore areas will be the coolest, 72 for their high away from those lakes and you're getting into the 80s. Then tonight, we turn partly cloudy with the south wind 5 to 10 miles per hour lows will range from the lower 60s to the lower 50s in the east. Your TV 6 day forecast. We will certainly heat things up by Thursday with a high near 90 degrees. And uh, we were supposed to get some cool relief by the weekend, but it's looking a little less likely with temperatures still near 80 at that point.